All right, guys, here we go with today's multiplayer round. We're going to try to get around with uh, Eagly and Westy. See if that works out. Um, and hopefully maybe someone else will join us. But let's get into this and see if we can meet him up. We're trying to meet at 735. Oh, we got Smoo. And I think that's Kanai. Where's Westy? Where's Henrik? Oh, that's funny. I didn't get either of the ones that I was trying to get. Oh, well. Still against a couple killers. Where's that John? Can't remember. I can't keep track of the no names anymore. Looks like I didn't get either of them. Dang. All right. We're going to try to go for the eagle here. Good old glide skip arrive on a forehand. Try to flux it through this gap. If it can miss the trees, this is going to be good. Oh yeah, this gives us a look. Hopefully we don't screw this up and go out of bounds. 113. I should probably throw the Svea. Although I haven't been throwing it as much anymore. 113 uphill. Yeah, I do that. I should have just thrown the, the pier. Man, I suck with that disc. I was doing good for a while and then... Not anymore. Just that's my common miss is I just don't put enough power on it. 7:38. I feel like if I remember right, I think that you can run this one. Let's try. I'm gonna try to skip it in with the skip sapphire. See how this works out for me. Well, that's way off to the right. Hopefully, it gets through that bush. But man, that was not lined up very good. Should have just done like a straight pull down from that aim point. Darn it. I want to practice this course. I haven't really put much time into figuring out lines on this course at all. We get two birdies. Now is our chance. Do we go for this? I imagine one, if not both of these guys are going to eagle this. So I just don't have a skippy flippy, so it's just a little harder for me other than my turn glide. So we're going to try my big flex line here with the glide skip rive. I'm not even looking where those guys are. I don't want to know yet. Is it going to turn enough? Uh, I don't know. That might still be OB. Dang it. Stop. 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 Oh my goodness. That was close. All right. So from here. Oh, it's a close one. I didn't even need to do that. I'm so stupid. For some reason I thought it was a full distance and it's not. Oh well, this should make for an easy eagle. 400 feet. Let's go. I'm just going to go power down with the, the vandal here. Don't need much of this with this big tailwind. Probably need more than that. No, that should be alright. I was just worried about going long. Could have done better than that, but that'll work. 47 feet downhill into the wind. Got the eagle tied with somebody. I think it's John. I don't know. I'll find out soon enough. All right. Forehand with the roll sapphire. Middle chevron right on the edge of this tree. Straight pull from there. Go right in the middle of this tree. You're usually pretty good. I always get a little nervous with that roll disc landing before the out of bounds but worked out and sometimes the glide can be a little too far I do miss having the PD in the bag as an option on this hole but <clears throat> until they fix the bag swap option I probably won't have the PD in my bag unfortunately so one wind here is usually just a glide sapphire middle chevron on the left side of that bridge and I do about a disc of Anheuser Hopefully we stay away from the bridge and hopefully we don't go too far past it. We're all about the same spot there within a couple feet of each other for the birdie. And we maintain that one shot lead. Surprise, Westy didn't message me. I wonder, I imagine him and Henrik got in the same card and I just missed him. All right, we're going light glide rive here. Middle Chevron under this tree. Not quite a disc of Annie with this 
wind should have gone a disc but that's still going to be safe we're just gonna have to deal with this big old rock over here a little bit but i'm used to that actually we got to the left of it 7 30 or 337 let's see here i think i'm just gonna power down the roll sapphire just a hair not much that looks fine. I'd rather miss a little left than right. I just hate going. Sometimes I'll just slide it just long to the right and end up OB. Just off the edge there. It's just drives me crazy every time I do that. All right. We're through the first two courses. I've been struggling with this hole a little bit, but we got a good wind here for the turn glide. Let's see if we can get this down there and maybe have a Small chance at an Albi. Come on, wind. Do your thing. Come on, wind. Oh, this could be good. Just don't get screwed by the railroad tracks. Oh, okay. Okay, stop. Phew. You never know with those tracks what's going to happen, but that worked out well. Oh, it looks like we're going to get the lead here. Let's see if we can drop in an albatross. That would be sweet. I just don't know what to even try. Maybe maybe a skip sapphire. Kind of high and like big flex. Let's try that. Long shot here. I don't even know if it has a distance even if I got it lined up. Not a bad attempt, but I think it still would have been short. Probably would have had to throw something more. But we still get the eagle, and we take the lead with two holes to go. Against these two, I'll take that any day. Par 4 coming up. What do we got? So, probably not the shot that's going to get me the closest, but it's been working out really well. Just the forehand, water skip gold. Put about a half a, half a power of Anheuser. Oh no, I needed more Anheuser. That's going to be safe, but it's just going to be a little ways away. It's a good shot if you have a one-shot lead, I suppose. It doesn't look like either of them are going to get the eagle, so we're in good shape here. 351. I'm going to go with the skip sapphire. Just try to skip it up there in between those teeth. Oh, did I throw it high enough? Okay, I was worried it was going to catch early. Ah, kind of a dud of a skip there, but should be able to save that. Smooth might have gone in the water. And still got that one shot lead going into hole number nine. Oh, he got ahead of me. Dang. Playing too slow. Talking too much. All right. This is roll sapphire for me. Hopefully he doesn't ace it. Top chevron kind of right in line with this. And I'll slide over to about right there. And then a straight pull. Maybe a touch of hyzer. Not much. This looks pretty perfect. No chance at acing it, but it should get me pretty close. Maybe even a putt, depending on how well it checks up. It does pretty well, and we're going to get this victory. Great way to end my morning. Time to watch some Olympics. Go to sleep. Wake up. Go to work. Watch some fights. There you go, guys. There's today's multiplayer round of the day. Let's take a look at... I don't know whose bag... We got the Rainmaker and the Harp, the Fuse and the MD1. I've seen that combo quite a bit lately. They just thought those were so similar. Maybe I just, I don't know. I figure, I feel like you can get a, a better spot there, but shoot, he knows better than I do. He's a better player than me. Uh, Brave and Explore, both roll. I like that a lot. Both of those are awesome discs. I wish I could bag some Braves. The Light Glide Paradigm, the Glide Skip Paradigm. He's got the Water Skip Roll Strive. It's an awesome looking disc right there. Is that for winning the one of the European ones? I would imagine that's the only way. To, I can't remember if I got that or not. I suck at remembering where discs come from and which ones are winning discs. Roll Sampo, Glide Sampo, Skip Sampo. Man, that Sampo is an awesome disc. I should probably consider switching to it. But I love my Sapphires too much. 
you notice he doesn't have a single sapphire in the bag so definitely possible used to be kind of king of the course as far as fairways but there's definitely some other good options got the same water skip gold as me and he's got that new glide skip prince so that's what his bag currently looks like all right let's take a look at the the leaderboard i'm not sure where i'm at i think i'm top 25 but nowhere near the top <clears throat> let's see daniel still holding it strong up top with a few of them tied for second there's smoo at seventh place 949 henrik's thunder horse he's got two in the top 10 well done but alt still suck <laughs> i hate them uh there we are 918 not too shabby just below the man reese just above the other man rauta just above my vandal companion dan and there's stever so surrounded by awesome players but there you go guys there's today's multiplayer round of the day i'm not going to forget it today thanks for watching me play some dgv